VPN. Why we want to connect with VPN? I have three branches. So maybe this is my Delhi office. This is Mumbai. This is Chennai. Okay. So over the internet, I will buy the normal routers, the router which support VPN. Over the internet, I'm going to connect all my offices with internet. And over the internet, we are going to connect all the offices with VPN. So maybe in Mumbai, we have server. So maybe in Chennai, we have uh, some another server. And uh, maybe in Delhi, we have a tele server. So we have different, different servers at different, different locations. We have a LAN network here. We have hundreds of users available in Delhi. So now all these users, they want to access these at tele server. Okay. Suppose these are accountants. So tele is basically a software for accountants. Suppose these all four accountants wants to access the tele server, which is in Mumbai. So we are going to connect my office with Mumbai office with the help of VPN. And with the help of VPN, what will happen? My private network, suppose this private is 192.168.1.0 and this is 192.168.2.0. So these are two private network. Can I ping your private IP? Because the routers which are used by ISP, so ISP routers block private IP. So then how this VPN technology is able to connect? So what is happening? So we are actually building a tunnel and we are sending our private information inside the tunnel. That is basically called VPN. So we are hiding the information from public that we are not actually dealing with the private to private IP. We are dealing from this router to this router. ISP will come to know, okay, the traffic is going from the Delhi router to the Mumbai router but in actual we are sending my internal traffic inside the tunnel where a tunnel is built between r1 and r2 right between delhi and mumbai